forget the stories with set heroes and villains, and let's dive into DC Comics' new movie, Suicide Squad. Villains, rejoice. This is Facts of Fandoms. The Suicide Squad is a group of criminals who are forced to work for the US government to complete missions that are absolutely suicidal. And the messed up part is that if these missions don't kill them, disobeying the government will. The Suicide Squad is mostly comprised of various criminals in the DC Universe. Some of the most well-known members are Deadshot and Harley Quinn. Not all members are villains though. These include Colonel Rick Flagg, Amanda Waller, aka The Wall, Vixen, and Superboy. See, they may not be villains, but they're still pretty badass. Suicide Squad is also known as Task Force X. Nice name, but it's a little too G-rated for my taste. There was quite the media buzz when it was announced that Jared Leto will be playing the Joker instead of Ryan Gosling, as Gosling has to turn down the role due to scheduling conflicts. Plans were also made for a Suicide Squad animated television series. Sadly, that was shot down because the creators, in the end, didn't actually think it was a good idea. Mel Gibson, the guy that famously said, you can take away our lives, but you will never take away our freedoms, has never appeared in the DC Universe. But his brother did. Donald Gibson was the voice behind Captain Boomerang in the Justice League TV series in the early 2000s. Too bad everyone in the squad had their freedom taken away. That's what makes this movie so compelling. You can never tell who's good and who's bad. And that's all for this episode of Facts of Fandoms. Are you going to go see the movie? If you are, hashtag Facts of Fandoms and let us know. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and share these facts if you want us to make more facts of your favorite fandoms. Oh look guys, even more videos. Why not check them out? You know you want to.